The late former Vice President Al Haji Ali Mahama has been described as a man of few words, cheerful, soft spoken, and a diligent personality. Dignitaries who converged at the Black Star Square in Accra said the late Vice President was always concerned about the safety and daily lives of people around him. I was with uh, our current Vice Presidential candidate, Dr. Baumia, in the northern part of the Volta region. Uh, so in the midst of what we were doing and the news coming to us at the time, it was great shock uh, and uh, it took us some time to actually digest uh, the news and also to accept it as a reality. But having become the vice president and me becoming the deputy minister for education, I worked so closely with him, so I've known him at that time in office as a very, very, very serious person. People have been saying that they, they have benefited from him. He was so concerned about, you know, um, with Telenta, we go to Tamale. You can't go to Tamale without hearing the name of Elijah Ali Mahama. And that is the, 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 the kind of work he did. He was a, a, you know, a very good philanthropist, and indeed, you know, he touched the life of many, many people. When His Excellency, former Vice President Ali Mahama, had the opportunity to serve this country, I think he did it with all seriousness. He was a great Vice President because you never heard any confusion or misunderstanding between him and his leader, the president. That was a mark of a leader. I would remember him greatly for the stance that he took on discipline and maintenance of standards. I think he was concerned about the daily lives of our people, the safety of our people, that our people reaching to higher, I mean, to greater heights, you know, and for me, I will always remember him for that. It is uh, an incalculable uh, loss in terms of the way he impacted uh, young people, uh, young Northerners, young Muslims, you know, who believed that he had achieved virtually the ultimate and who thought that, you know, his example is worth following. Right. But, of course, it's a legacy that he has left, really, that right. a lot of young people, <laughs> including myself, I'm no longer young, really, but I still believe that we can follow his uh, good example of uh, contributing to his nation, uh, you know, performing major roles in public life, and accomplishing uh, something really significant. Yeah.